take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Snowpiercer remind us of that. Inside the train, kids are taught that if you go outside, you're going to die, Jun Ho explained. And yes, in case you were wondering, the avalanche did, in fact, kill everyone left on board the Snowpiercer. Yes, they're all dead, Jun Ho claims, and that's a bit harsh. Point seven February 2018. Take our lead. Curtis breaks down with this confession and goes on to tell a story about how the mayhem died down. He recalls how younger, stronger men began murdering mothers just to eat their babies and how an old man sacrificed his own arm to stop the violence. Point 8 May 2019. Let's help you make your mark. The train literally runs on poor children. It can't stop because it doesn't know what else to do and it was built to continually consume. It has so much momentum that there is no way for it to be diverted. Within the context of the film, stopping would result in freezing, i.e., economic collapse. Make your mark Take our lead. In this video, Luke Palmer makes a surprisingly compelling case that Bong Joon Ho's Snowpiercer is actually a sequel to the beloved 1971 film Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. They're both two movies about groups of people that work their way through a large fantastic structure. Point 9 January 2019. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.